Yeah, you guessed it. It's raining again. Um, it's raining and I have no power. So, double bonus. No power means no internet, no TV, and no charging my phone to play games. And I can't go outside. What am I supposed to do? I don't know. I've been saying that I should work on an e-course, so I guess I'll do that. But, right now, I just... I cleaned up my room. See, it's all nice and tidy. Because I actually, like... I clean my room before they come in to clean my room. Because that just makes it easier on everybody, I think. And, um, I think I'm gonna call my mom. I miss my mom. Give her, give her a little chit chat with the 20% of battery I have left on my phone. <laughs> and now it's clean. Like really clean. It smells clean. My favorite part is the free water. Two bottles every time. Bye, um, Gone in a day. I should get my room clean and everything. The only problem with getting my room clean is the amount of effort it takes to put it back the way I like it. I still don't have any power. And this is going to be a serious issue in about 30 minutes because all my electronics are going to die. Except for my camera, so I might get some crazy footage, I don't know. Um, it's been two hours and there's still no electricity. So I'm going to go see if the restaurant is serving food or if I can find a place that maybe has a generator going because... Not much to do right now. I've just been informed that the electricity will come back on at 4 o'clock. And just to give you an idea, right now it's like 1. And it's been off since 10. I know I probably sound like a baby, like I should go out tanning or something. But since I'm on antibiotics, I can't even enjoy the sunshine. But the good news is I'm not going to starve. And they can make breakfast. <laughs> Okay, so now we're on a new mission to find electricity. There's two places in the area that I think might have it, so we'll go check them out and see if we have any luck. First place, bust. Yes, I can hear music playing, so that's a good sign. We're back at The Rock, so here's hoping. this. Just, just in the nick of time. Just powered off. This place never lets me down. And really, can you beat it? Like, I might not hear every day. Life. nice um, Thai iced coffee which is pretty good they don't like put sugar in it but they put like sweetened milk in it so it's all right it's not as good as a caramel macchiato but it'll do and one benefit of not being able to connect to the internet is I was finally able to run Omni Sweeper and check this out look at this 13 13 gigs my iPhoto library my photo library has been taking up 13 gigs, like, on my computer, and that's on top of the photo library 
So there's like doubles and stuff. So I'm about to free up a ton of space, which is amazing because I was really low. I'm like down to like eight gigs of space left, which is not easy to um, edit movies with. <laughs> So it's about 3.30 now, and as far as I can tell, there's still no electricity. At least the Wi-Fi wasn't working where I just was, but that's all right. Maybe the store will be open and I can get a little bit of grocery shopping done. <sighs> Do you ever like walk into a room and even though there's no power, you still try to turn the lights and then wonder why the lights don't turn on. Or maybe you use the toilet just to remember that you can't flush it. Yeah, I've been there. Anyway, so at least the store was open and I picked up my essentials. Peanut butter. Look at this tiny little, it's tiny. Um, but this thing, it's 75 baht. And so that's like two bucks. Not bad. You can make it last a little over a week. And then I decided to try Tim Tam. I believe it's from Canada. And it's I've heard it's amazing. Chocolate sandwich biscuits. So excited to try that. <sighs> um Yeah. I have to keep my door open so that some air can come in. And I'm really hoping nothing too big crawls or flies in through that gap. Just the breeze, please. Didn't even think about this, but look at that. It's defrosting. And there's so much water. My pathetic little fridge. Got some cucumbers, a carrot, and some yogurt. Which is pretty much all I'm living off of is yogurt right now because it's back! Yay! Guess what's back? Back again. The lights are back. Yay! And just in time for me to officially try the Tim, Tim Tam. Kind of melty because there was no um, air conditioning in the store that was selling them. Mm. Mm. It was really good. Kind of like two graham crackers covered in chocolate with a different kind of chocolate inside. I might get addicted to these. <laughs> I was reading the package and I think I have to apologize. I think Tim Tams are from Australia. Not what that dumb girl said earlier. I was reading it because it says that it's a product of Indonesia, not for sale in Australia or New Zealand and that it's imported by Campbell Soup Asia. It's seriously is like a lot of different things happening. Campbell Soup to Asia from Indonesia, but Campbell Soup is American and it's just insane. Sorry, I got distracted. I was seeing if it has aspartame because I'm allergic to aspartame, but it doesn't seem like it does. Got here, got my food, my YouTube. And just in time for the rain. So, I was trying to upload you amazing quality videos. You know, I went to my little iMovie thing and I clicked file and I clicked 1080p best pro resolution and better quality compression and then I went to my YouTube and I've been sitting here for an hour and a half and I'm at 5% it's not gonna work so gonna try to just change it up a little bit and see if I can make the size a little bit smaller but still give you guys great content because I feel like I feel like the videos 
that I've been putting out are good, but they could be better, especially if the resolution was better. So. Okay, so. Got my computer all charged up, and now I'm gonna run down to Nero's and see if I can't finish uploading the videos. But I'm gonna call that a night for the vlogging. I'm really tired, and I can just upload and go to sleep and hopefully get more than three hours of sleep tonight. Anyway, guys, peace out. Good night. See you tomorrow. It's my first mail day. It's so exciting. Because my mom loves me. I don't know if you caught that address, but don't send anything to it because I'm going away in like a month and it wouldn't get here. But, um, yeah.